YouTube universe. What is good? What is happening? What's crack a lacking? It's your favorite role model, Hitman Thornton for Raw Reaction TV. And this is my review of Fear of the Walking Dead. Good episode. I mean, not a whole lot of excitement going on, but good episode. I mean, the pier zombie die thing, that was cool how they walked him off the pier. That was cool. I like that. But before we get into all that, Nick got him some. Nick and Luciana. We I kind of saw that. I had a feeling that wasn't going to happen. It was only a matter of time. But he got himself some. Hopefully that will calm his little crackhead ass down. And him stop being so daredevilish and fearless all the damn time. So maybe he'll get some common sense now. Now, you know, you know, getting some can loosen you up and clear the cobwebs and give you a clear thinking, you know. Quick nut. Ugh. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, he got himself some happy. Now let's see where it takes his mindset. <laughs> and uh, that was a cool little uh, Breaking Bad moment. Him and uh, El Alejandro, you know, making the pills. Alejandro, if I'm saying it right. Making little pills for the cartel. Uh, you know, to buy them time or hope or whatever. Uh, hopefully that works. You know, the cartel that's, you know, got that cock costco s type of place on lockdown where they get groceries. So let's see if that works. Maybe, maybe not. Get that little tweak on it. Hopefully Nick doesn't take some. You know, so we shall see. But, um, but yeah, that little pure thing, and uh, that was Alicia's idea. That was a cool idea. Um, and yeah, uh, so Alicia, Madison, uh, Strand, Victor Strand, uh, they found out to be okay after the whole after they were trapped in the bar with the zombies, but they were able to get out. They showed they got out while they were drunk. You know, by the way, let's keep that in mind. They were still drunk. Um, but yeah, so, and they all decide to walk together with that wedding party or part of the wedding party that got left in there. That um, Elena, that's the hotel worker, trapped him in there. So I guess they decide to talk to him and negotiate to work together. I mean, the mother of the bride, because her daughter died, you know, she still has issues in working with them. They, because uh, the one guy who was the, uh, who was the husband of the bride who survived? He said, "You guys can stay, but that one girl got to go." And Madison's like, "Hey, she's sorry, you know, you know, she regretted it, but you know that's how it was. That's it's the way it is right now. But right now we got to work together. We got to work together because there's gonna be some people that may show up at this place and try to take it over, you know, down the road. So we need to work together. Oh well." So, but they ended up did working together, you know, and they led, uh, Alicia came up with the idea of leading the dead off the pier into the water. That was pretty cool. Um, of course, Madison took the lead of that, you know, she was the Pied Piper, I guess, if you want to call it, you know, got him off the pier. But we also saw in previous episodes or last season that the dead does kind of survive in water, you know, so what if they come back on land? But there was that sign that said no swimming because of the riptide. So, eh, we shall see. We'll see if that works. But but overall, it was a good episode. It was pretty cool. I'm more interested in seeing the next episode to see what happens with Chris and Travis. You know, Chris's little knucklehead boys in the hood son now. And see what their relationship or what's going to happen with that situation after what he did. So... Kind of interested to see what's going to happen next week with that. But overall, it was a cool episode. It was a cool episode. So, so in the meantime, yeah, post, you know, give me some feedback. Tell me what y'all thought of the episode, you know. So, so in the meantime, between time until next time, it's your favorite role model, Hitman Thornton for Raw Reaction TV. Peace out, bitches.